Yeah, I'll help me get this piece out. Can we do it? Volunteers are ripping out a floor fouled by flood water in a small home. The moisture is trapped between the two layers of plywood, so we want to get this bottom layer uh, dried out. So we got to pull this top layer out to enable it to dry out. That does not look easy. No, it's, uh, it's glued down, it's nailed down, and it's a lot of hard work. But necessary. The Salvation Army's Dana Libby says about 50 families live in this Snohomish neighborhood that was hit by November floods. Virtually all of them had some damage. These down here, there's probably 10 or 15 that, that got the worst. Many of the homes belong to young immigrant families. Elizabeth Mendez says the floodwaters came in quickly, forcing her to flee with her four children. That's a lot of kids to get out of the house. Yes. But you got out all safe, okay? See, <laughs> see. Si. Now they're back. Where's that ripper? With volunteers from the Salvation Army and Snohomish County churches. Wiring and pulling up floors, and we're doing whatever we can do to help. The key is you've got neighbors coming together and helping each other out. There's a lot of cleanup and then rebuilding to do. The help is ongoing and much appreciated. Mucho, mucho. Yes. Thank you very much. In Snohomish, Heather Bosch, News Radio 710 Cairo.